Yeah, it's like super cute. Like, like is that where they film movies? I don't know. It's like a little western town. This is really cool. Wow. One thing we really wanted to do in Colorado is check out a hot spring. This is the road that leads to the Piedra River Hot Spring, which is located in the San Juan National Forest. are here right now yeah. I'm imagining that it's only gonna get busier our goal was to get here and have nobody at the hot spring but of course that doesn't always happen um, this is gonna be the first time that we've actually been to a hot spring we went to different um, natural springs but never a hot spring so mm -hmm. this is gonna be our first experience yes we're just gonna decide whether we should go now. I think we should get ready now. Mm -hmm. And I think we should just go now, actually. Just go now. Yeah. There's a trail that way. And we gotta hike a mile and a half to get to this hot spring. I don't know where Nala is. Nala! What are you doing? You stay. You stay close to daddy, okay? In bear country. All these tips, tricks, what to do, what not to do. Over here is uh, a little more information on fish, trout. I love rainbow trout. It looks fresh. That's kind of weird, but anyway. So I guess there's a, a couple vehicles here already. We're kind of hoping to be the only ones, but we don't we don't know how it's going to be, how big it is, if it's private. Uh, just as long as there aren't any nude people, because that's, especially for Carrie, that's a no-go for her. <laughs> for me, it's just a little uncomfortable, I guess, too. I'm not used to that stuff, but um, Nala keeps wanting to, she keeps wanting to sniff that thing. <laughs> oh, there's people coming. I guess we're not the only ones. Nala, come. Come on. But I don't know um, what this is going to look like, smell like, feel like, so we're gonna go check it out here soon. More people are showing up, it's getting later in the day. It is dark out, we did not go to the hot springs, but we will in the morning, hopefully. We're gonna watch a movie now. Um, you may be wondering, hey, how are you watching a movie? Um, we have no Wi-Fi, well, I guess we could rent a movie, 
But another thing we like to do is um, with Windows 10, um, we could download um, Netflix movies. And so this is one of our downloads. And this movie we're going to watch is called Into the Forest. So we're going to do that, eat some pizza, and then we'll catch you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody. So it's just us this morning, and we are going to go head down to the hot springs. Now the baby's coming along. Carrie's just about... Look at her, she looks all nice and warm, and she's just excited to go. You just never know. <laughs> Isn't it cold, babe? It's freezing. It's freezing, so we're hoping that this... Ooh. this um... Hopefully we'll be brave enough to shed some layers to jump in there. <laughs> we'll see, huh? So this, this trail is splitting up in like many multiple ways, and we're just sticking to this side, to the right side of every trail. And we're also following now the baby. Um, as you can see, I think I think she's guiding us the right direction. And then we're gonna we're gonna trust her senses as to where the most traffic is. And because of her nose, we're assuming that the most traffic is on this trail here. So we'll see. We'll see if her little baby's right. I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see Look at this. Look, look how it curves. Oh, it goes Doot Poop on there. Do, poop. Yeah. Doot Doot It just like goes like a, a zigzag Did you literally just step on bear poop? I don't know what that is. Yesterday I saw this family come up with um, they had just gotten back from the trail, and they we were parked here a long time yesterday, and they were here the whole entire time. And we were wondering, like, wow, they're really spending a long time. Well, they came up, and they had a kid with them in a stroller. So, can you imagine taking a stroller down this? <laughs> I think you just made that harder than it should have been. I know. And this is the way that he should have taken. <laughs> From up here, the world seems small. We can sit together. It's so beautiful. This is so nice. This is way better than I thought it was. It does not be. smell like sulfur. It doesn't smell very bad. I don't smell anything. I could literally float here too. It's perfect temperature. We're sitting right now, so like our butts are touching the rocks on the yeah. bottom, the sandy rock type of material on the bottom, just to kind of give you an idea of how deep mm. it is. Um, but yeah, this is awesome. There's nobody. It's just us and Nala. She, she wants to get in the water. She, yeah. Aww. You want to no, get in baby. the water, but it's too hot for you. I want to sink my head in so badly, <laughs> but somebody said, somebody commented said, don't don't stick your head in the in this kind of water because you can get some like thing that goes through the nose, the a bacteria nose, that a bacteria that can go through your nostrils. Your but it's so tempting to just sink my head in. Yeah. I should I should looked it up. Okay. It's I won't. Not worth it. <laughs> but I just gonna fill up a little bit. <laughs> and then you fall back. So there's a a hot spring pool there. There, 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 and back there. Um, the one over there in that area is the deepest. And it's the hottest too. So, And it's only getting hotter throughout the day. It was so awesome. I did not want to leave at all. I know. And like when we got out, we were kind of like lightheaded and it's just so relaxed. Like it feels like we just went to a spa it just feels, feels really amazing awesome. it feels amazing i've never experienced anything like that no this is the best first experience we could have possibly had yeah it was just like everything was perfect it was so, perfect now we gotta hike up now we gotta hike up all the whole trail that we hiked downward we're going back up up so it's gonna be extremely hard and uh, we'll yeah. fill you in on how we feel after we get all the way back up. Yep. 
you and me we meant to be in the great outdoor forever free finally made it oh that was tiring i'm so out of shape Now, it's time to have something. My favorite. What is that? Pizza. Cold pizza. I love cold pizza. Time to, so much her. for, look at her. She's just getting started. <laughs> she's like, okay, um, I'm ready to play now after all that. You hurt your nail. She hurt her nail. She ran in circles around us through this whole trail. And now she wants to keep going. I don't know. She's crazy. Look at that. That's just. We are ready to eat. And honestly, if I could do what I wanted to do right now, I would literally just like set up a hammock and just chill the rest of the day. Yeah. But we have some things to do. We gotta hit the road. We're gonna go down to my uncle's. And so we gotta. Skedaddle on that. Time to gain those calories back. Cold pizza. It was the perfect day. Nobody was there. It was just us. And we left at the perfect time because, you see behind us, as soon as we were walking out, everybody was walking in. So it's like we, we started the trail at like 8 in the morning, 8.30, and now it's like 1, 1 1.30. If you guys ever, ever come here, hopefully these sticks are here. You guys can use them. Make sure you put them back so we can continue to share the wealth. So, let's see here. I'm gonna put it right, you know what, let's put it right there. And let's, let's just hope that they stay there. Okay, so there you go guys. It's right, see the camper right there? It's about, I wanna say, 60 feet out in behind this tree. Got it? It is time to eat cold pizza. Oh, look at another truck camper like ours. Follow trampers, I must say. Let's see. Same color, same kind of setup like ours. I love cold pizza. Mm. I've been, lately I've been into like this, like eating ketchup with my pizza. I used to be like this in high school and then like I wasn't into it, but now I'm really getting into it again. The whole ketchup and pizza deal. It's just so, mm. I talked to the uh, the gentleman in the truck camper. We got to talk, and he was asking me, like, you know, a little how to get to like the hot springs, and gave him some basic directions as far as our experience goes. But um, it turns out that he was coming. Actually, he's coming from Alaska. He does commercial fishing over there, and now he's over here just traveling the country. It's really cool to meet people and see their um, their journey and their travels and especially you know people that have the same similar uh, setup as ours uh, it's really cool so I wish him all the best and and his journey and travels it's just it's awesome and it kind of confirms and it kind of like makes us feel like like we're not alone in this either you know there's people out there that do this too so it's it's really cool Babe. I need more pizza. No. Can I have yours? No way. No. Fine. There's the uh, there's our fellow tramper. It looks like he has a, a wood um, fire stove um, on the top. I can see like some kind of a chimney type deal. So you talked to him? I talked to him. Yeah. What did he say? I already told everyone what he said. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta watch the video then. Now we are going back down this windy road until we get to the main road. So until then. I am going to be getting some holiday recipes ready. Sometimes you need to go and take a step back to see the truth.
to be.